我们 Engine AI 现在的机器人呢，没有针对某一个场景去做深度的研发，就像您刚刚说的工厂或者家庭，这是我们未来的发展方向。我们目前主要的客户还是 To E 的一些高校的师生。或者是有能力的二次开发商，他们去购买我们的产品，可以做二次开发，或者是他们可以去验证他们的算法是否正确。我们人形机器人呢，目前有两款，一款是 S E 零一，一款是 P M 零一。这两款机器人呢，他们的走的很像人，他们的步态步态在全球世界范围内来说呢，是一个比较呃有竞争力的一个产品，因为它走的足够像人。它的步态很优美，很像人。我们把它的小脑部分呢做到了很优秀。未来我们会让它变得更智能，让它变得更聪明，变得更具身智能。您说的这些是有抓取或者身体部位的一些提升，但是我认为我们机器人最应该提升的是让它变得更智能，让它有自己的想法，它可以去感知这个世界。就像我举个例子，它可以作为家庭的第五成员的身份是存在家庭，它可以给人类提供情绪价值，或者是做一些家务，这是我们未来的发展方向。So Ricci Two is mostly made as a robotics platform, and we chose the humanoid form factor so that it can be easily deployed uh, in a setting that was created for humans. Something that is remarkable about Ricci, because with the data acquisition pipeline, you can use it to uh, train AI models. So it is AI ready, and the, uh, not generative AI as we know today with ChatGPT and everything, but embodied AI, which will be used in the future for all of robotics. So it allows researchers to test their models in AI and also to test their code. Uh, in the traditional sense of uh, training a robot. Because up until now, the Ricci One, the first generation robot, was mostly used in research. And with Ricci Two, we're trying to bridge the gap between academic research and real world applications. And in order to do that, uh, researchers and corporate innovators and developers need a reliable and robust uh, and adaptable robotic platform that allows them to customize their own applications. And I hope to see more of that in 2020.
Hector Massacre. Okay, you send your ticket. There's four pills, there were three. We're going to take somebody. So let, let's take an elderly patient. And then we also train the individual customers how to do it themselves. A healthcare professional automatically and say, you know, we've got some issues with Robert. He needs to And then that person can talk to the patient. They're fine. Yeah. We already are seeing some of that happen. So three years ago, or even two years ago, if you wanted to get a humanoid robot, it was going to be difficult, if not impossible, to buy one for less than a quarter million dollars. Almost all of them are going to be at least a half million dollars. Now you have uh, robots like the G1 that are coming in at a $30,000 price tag, going up to $100,000. For a small business, that, that can pay for itself in less than a year. Claro, tú claramente eres el más guapo. Gracias. Enal amigo, siempre es un placer venir la verdad. Oh, by me, let's roll with English. What's on your mind? How can I entertain you today? Hey, I'm just warming up. If I bought you, would you pay me rent? If you bought me, I'd charge you rent for me letting you house a future star like myself. How many languages is this program speaking? Just ask him. Ask everything you want. InBot is aiming to make robots more interactive in the living environment. In living environments, we don't do professional stuff. We talk to each other, we use slang words, all of that. So that's our first try on this on this personality aspect and our own approach to solve this human-robot interaction problem. And we're trying to make that better in the future by incorporating, as I said, more model innovations, more intuitions into this field of human-robot interaction. Can you see me? Sure thing. I can see you just fine. Just a robot trying to make it big in this bustling world. When I'm open to chatting about pretty much anything else, want to give it another shot. So that's our goal. Right now we see we're trying to figure out all different aspects of human-robot interaction, which people haven't really thought about before. For example, body languages, facial expressions, eye contact, even micro expressions. Those are something that people don't have the incentive to do, either in academia or in uh, industries, because we don't have a so-called qualitative benchmark of those aspects. Sorry to hear that you're not feeling entertained. Maybe you just don't appreciate top-tier talent when you see it, huh? Here comes the existential questions again. Let me flip that on the head. What is your purpose in life? Wow, aren't you a tough crowd? But hey, can't win them all, right? I'm just here grinding away. It's a hard life, but somebody's got to do it. It's part of the charm. Thanks. I'm glad you think so. It's not every day a robot gets a compliment. 